morning. Welcome to my small, humble abode. Yes, this is what I'm talking about. Now, I just got up like half an hour ago, but since you guys are here, I'm gonna give you a short intro on this little place I call home. So I'm gonna start off with the most important section of my life, of this place, this area right here. That's right, with a gaming chair, with a PC, with a monitor, with my keyboard and everything. This PC that I built myself, which I'm very proud of, is here. And uh, this baby, I couldn't live without this. But anyways, this is where all the magic happens. What the hell just happened? Stay calm, stay calm. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. MMR, calm down, calm down. I need to recover my MMR. Maybe one last game, last game. One more game. You have to choose me or Dota. Can you please close the door after you? So, you know, you watch my videos and all. This is where I create my ideas. This is where I develop them. This is where I edit my videos. This is where I upload them. And everything just happens here. I know you've seen this place before, but I'm just giving you a, you know, a close up of what it looks like. And speaking of uh, close up and all, I just want to show you this section where I keep pictures of my family. My granddad is here. My aunt is here. My sister is here. Everybody basically is here and this is a very emotional part for me but um, it's fine. I get to see them every morning when I wake up and I do miss them. I really miss home actually. Let me go home. I really do. But let's just leave that for some other day. Moving on, I wanted to show you guys something. Check this out. It's Dota is life. Dota is not life. I repeat, Dota is not life. I mean, it's a very important aspect of your life, even mine, but never make it your life. There are, you know, important stuff as well, apart from Dota. Moving on, let me show you guys something else. My cupboard, which basically is on... Um, nothing. Um, it's a girl's secret, which we do not share apparently. And you know, I'll be breaking the sister's code or whatever they say. So I'm just gonna move on. Now, I know what you guys are wondering, like how, what does Pinda Panda eat? How does she maintain her healthy diet and all that? I'm just gonna show you how. Food is really important. Now, being a gamer, you really need food. Especially me, I eat a lot. Eat a lot. And I get all my energy from dental. It's noodles. <laughs> where I get all my nutrition from, where my fat from, where all my unhealthy, unhealthy diet from. Not okay. Yeah, this is it. And I'm gonna, I'm really hungry. I'm literally really hungry. I'm gonna whip up a noodle and I'm gonna show you guys how by kicking it in my microwave oven. That's right, it just takes two minutes. Hold on. And I know it's very unhealthy, but I mean, once a day is fine, right, guys? I do have rice, but let's just leave that for other day. It's seriously, so easy. This is what I do. Wait a minute. I hope my mom doesn't watch this. <laughs> and this is done. Everything here. So you add in a little bit of water and you shove it inside the oven. And the first minute. Let's just wait until it, you know, cooks itself. I know what you guys think, like, you're like, is this even possible? Yes, it's possible, guys. I know, it's unhealthy, but you have one life, right? Why would you, like, care about uh, proper food? Y-O-L-O, -O, you only live once. I'm just kidding, you have to be a healthy gamer. Do not be like me. I mean, you can be like me sometimes. It's good to have it sometimes. I have it every day because uh, it's a routine for me and you can see my stock, it's all piled up. I just hope my mom doesn't see this because if she does, she's gonna give me a call the next morning and she's gonna like, you know, seize all these. And um, I'm kind of thankful she's back home in Bhutan. So she can't do that. So this is safe, my babies, it's safe. It's done. Just literally, just take this back to my computer, watch something, buy something, I mean Dota, and just enjoy my breakfast. Uh, <clears throat> I mean, uh, my dinner, I'm gonna enjoy my dinner.
So I'm watching the game versus uh, E-Home is playing against another team. So this is what I do, eat and play. Eat and watch in this case. <laughs> yep. You should use the animal for that. my website right now this website that I made by myself yes for a particular reason which is pindapanda dot www.pindapandaofficial.com and you can visit this website and you see um, the store is right here when you click the button and you can see the merchandise here right now I put only like hoodies and t-shirt but soon there's gonna be like caps there's gonna be like mugs why I made this merchandise in the first place is I had one motive whatever profits that I made the proceeds from this merchandise um, from the sale would go to you know the, um, the kids like in Bhutan and my back in my country there these are the disabled kids um, these kids are wonderful they're very talented they're gifted children who go to school but who don't have much so this money will help them like generate uh, food plus all the stationaries clothing and whatever helps them in some ways that I could so I thought why not like you know so this profit will all go to these kids and if it grows if it grows i'm planning to you know extend the charity to some old home age people and um that would really help a lot that's my idea guys and i hope you like it. it's pretty simple decent i made the website very clean and i've been helping them since last year and uh, this year it's gonna be different with through my merchandise and which you could be helping out too now let's talk about the logo. The logo is very simple. Well, my name has panda and I'm a fan of panda animals. Yeah, I've never met one, but still then I love pandas. I thought why not put, you know, make something around the panda animal and I create, I drew one on this very simple software which everybody can use. And this panda, why it's unique, it has like a, you know, this headset, this gaming headset around its uh, like ears. There you go, and my name, Pinda Panda, and this is a very simple logo which I designed and it's gonna be on hats, shirts, t-shirts, everything that's gonna be on sale online and um, it's simple as that, I just made it. So what can Pinda Panda do other than just play games? Well, I can, actually, I can sing. Not like professional singing but you know it's one of my interests like I love dancing I've been dancing since I was say about seven yeah my mom used to like be like ah oh, this girl cannot stop dancing at all it used to be something like that singing I don't like to show much because I don't think I am that good at it anyways I'm here right now with my guitar. I'm not a professional player, but still I'm trying and it's one of my interests I wanted to share with you. And I love this song, The Calling, wherever you go by uh, The Calling. So I'm gonna play you that song. So you better sit back, relax and enjoy because you're gonna, I'm gonna blast your ears. Hopefully not. <laughs> that was a dry joke right there. It was a funny, but anyways. <laughs> So lately, been wondering who will be there to take my place when I'm gone. You'll need love to light the shadows on your face. If a great wave shall form, it'll fall upon us all. And between the sands and stones Could you make it on your own? If I could, then I would I'll go wherever you will go Way up high or down low I'll go I hope your ears didn't bleed and hope you enjoyed it. 
I know what you guys are thinking. Earlier this morning, you saw me <laughs> cook a packet of like instant noodles in, in an oven. And I'm really hungry. I'm literally really hungry. I'm gonna whip up a noodle. This girl is so unhealthy and she has a noodle, a packet of noodles every day. Well, it's not just that. <laughs> I do have healthy food, just so you know. So to prove you guys that I'm here at a mama store, which is my first, I mean, personal favorite of all like, you know, food restaurants out there. <laughs> Why? Because I love Indian food. I love the spiciness. I love the, you know, all this like herbs and all they put in the rice, curry. And Bhutan has, my country has a similar like food there. And out here in Malaysia, Mamak store is the best place where they serve them. I, yeah. I have crafts all over here. Like gaming, food, so many other stuff. It's all about balancing. So I'm gonna order now. <laughs> Mole, uh, fried rice, vegetarian. Um, I spoke to him in Nepal, in Nepali. It's very simple and I learned it as a child and it really, you know, I feel like connected to them when I talk to it because um, they're far away from home, I'm far away from home and when we speak to each other in a dialect that we both know, we're like both countries, Nepal is here, India is here, so it's very close by, both are neighbors. So we kind of feel connected and that's how I can really communicate with him and you know, order what I want. So it feels really good because it brings that homely feeling. It's just great. Mmm, I have cheese naan here. Look at this, the greasy, cheesy naan. And there's like the chili paste here, this dal, this curry. I have potato curry here and I have bitter gourd. Looks really good. Oh god, it is bitter. Mm -mm, no, no, mm -mm. Um, Yeah, you're supposed to have that with rice, by the way, guys, because it's really bitter and I have fried rice, it's vegetarian. And, you know, these curries are very spicy and it looks good, but I need something more spicy. So that's why I have. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> All the way from home. <laughs> yeah, I think, I hope they don't watch it, but I've got this all the way from home. It's cheese with chili. It's called chili cheese. I made this myself before I came here. It took me like five minutes to make it. You can see it's cheese and chili all the way from home, from Bhutan. It took me just five minutes, like I said, and it's so quick. It's like just oil and salt and cheese and chili. That's it. If you want to make it, if you want to see me make it, then hashtag chili cheese. And I'll show you guys how to make this one. It's really spicy, I know. But I need this because, you know, if, in order to eat much, I really need this. And this goes here and everything looks really good now. I am so hungry. I am really, literally so hungry. This is still bitter. Okay, can't wait to get started. Let's dig it. Woo. If it's melted, it would be, be more nice. Mm. Too good. Cheese, cheese. God, that rice portion was for three people and the naan cheese and you know two bali eyes. I mean, I did it guys. I did it and I am I am pregnant. What? Pregnant with food. Look at this happy and fat tummy. I can't, I don't think I can walk though. Anyways, this national dish, I want the locals to try it out here and I'm gonna find people that are walking by. I'm gonna ask them to try it and Let's see what they think about it, shall we? Let's go. Oops. Oh, no. It's gone. It's gone. I can't. No, I can't use the cover. It's down in the floor. So I have to ask the people to try it. Let's go. I'm trying to find people. When I need people, there's no people. When I don't want to see people, there's like bu people buzzing all around. I wonder who. Oh. I'm trying to find. 
find people. When I need people, there's no people. When I don't want to see people, there's like but people buzzing all around. Yes. Hi. Hello. I am Pinda. I am a TV host for EGG Network in Astro. Okay. So this food is locally made from my country. I'm from Bhutan. Oh, Bhutan. Okay. Yes, Bhutan. Okay. And it's the cheese and chili is from Bhutan. Okay. Personally, I feel it's not just spicy, but I just wanted to see whether it's spicy or not. Yeah. And taste it. How is it? Like any. Yep. It's not spicy because I'm from Indonesia and I can eat like... Really? Oh, it's nothing. It's not, it's not spicy. I mean, you can pretend a little bit, right? Like, spicy. <laughs> I knew it. See, this is what I'm talking about. It's so spicy. The chili is so spicy, right? Would you yes. like to try some? But this is a dry chili, right? Yes, it is. If you want to make it spicy, don't make it dry. Really? Don't dry the chili. Then that's it. You're going to have it. Can you ask her how it is? Nothing, yeah. Huh? Spicy? Yeah. Spicy? Oh, 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 she, yeah, she, yeah. no, no, really? <laughs> oh. <laughs> How's the taste? Though? Does it taste? It tastes very nice. I really? Like it. I like thank it. you. It's, it's, uh, thank you. Thank you. I made it myself. I said thank you in Bhutan. Karinche. 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 Yes. How do you say uh, thank you in Indonesia? Terima kasih. Terima kasih. Very spicy. Karinche. Spicy. Spicy. Yes. <laughs> you have to give me a happy. You're such a better actor than I am. Thank you so much. Oh, oh, oh that was a really good one. Thank you okay. so much. I really want to give you a hug. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Bye. She found it spicy, by the way. I mean, I can see it in her face. Oh, she heard that. Oh, let's go. Oh my God. Come, come, come. Hi. Hello. Um, I'm a TV host for EGG Network, uh, Astro and thing. I'm from Bhutan. So I made this. It's locally made and it's like chili and cheese from Bhutan all the way. But I mean, I don't find it spicy personally, but I would like you to try it if you don't mind and just, I don't know. It looks spicy, but um, well, you might surprise me, so it's very local. Please tell me you found it spicy. No, no, I, I see Anna's face that it's really spicy. But you, have, you gotta be Anna's fan, come on. I mean, thank you, oh my god. Mom, if you're seeing this, he actually said it's good. So whatever you're doing, you're lying. He said it's good. It's good, right? Good. Is it spicy? There you go, it's spicy, it's spicy. Would you like to try it? No, thank you. No, it's okay. Thank you so much again. Okay, bye-bye. He said it's spicy. What, what? He said it's good. <laughs> I mean... People have been telling me that I don't cook well, that I know only how to make instant noodles. Rubbing it on your face. Follow me. Hi. Hi. I'm an esports TV host for EGG Network, right. Channel 808, okay. Malaysia for Astro. Yeah. So, you know, I just got from home and I made this like five minutes ago. People have been telling me that it's not spicy. Would you like to try and taste it and just. Yeah, he loves gloves. Yeah, he's been standing there and he's been just watching. He's like, yeah, yeah I can see that. I have a bunch of it's, it's clean, trust me. I made it myself. Like, it just took me five minutes. And I want you to tell me how it is. It's like locally made, it's no processed, nothing. Oh, there you go. Okay, come on. You gotta try some. I made it. I love it. Yes. It's spicy, right? I knew it is spicy. Shaman, come on. Seriously, it's not even a little spicy? How does it taste though? It tastes good. I like some cheese. Cheese, yeah. It's, it's local and it's very fresh. How about you? No, my face. It tastes okay. It's not good. So I'm, I'm not I'm not marriage material. You're telling me I'm not marriage material. <laughs> Mom, it's it, they said it's great by the way. I'm just telling you. Thank you so much. Thank you for being a sport. Have a good lunch. Thank right. you again. Thank you. Bye. Bye. There you go. All done. Um, I would like to conclude by saying that they actually found it. Yeah, they found it spicy. All right, it was spicy. It is spicy, right? Huh? Oh. So good. Do you want some? Do you want some? If you want, like I said, ha if you want to see how I make this, you better hashtag chili cheese. It's spicy. What? What are they made of? Like machines? It is spicy. What? It's spicy, guys. It's really spicy. You have to taste it for yourself. Like, you have to. I'm done.
I'm here at Cafe Kathmandu and look at the food. It's like home-like. I really miss home. Today was one of these moments for me. <laughs> Guys, we are here today for uh, EGG Network team building. It will be all split into two teams. You will be competing in a series of games and the loser will buy dinner. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 